Welcome back to Mango Plays Ridgeside Village and let's say hello to everyone. Hello, good morning. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, enjoy the cubes there. Hello, how you doing, Pixie? You alright, Bella? And how you doing? You alright, Sam? And Sairi, of course, the OG. Alright, let's get the cactus watered. And then I think we should head out, grab our honey. Getting some more honey um, being produced, I think, would be a good idea. Because we can convert that into good stuff. Uh, mead, for example. We have quite a bit. Um, berry rose honey should be sold. Yeah. Immediately. There we go. Uh, let's grab Noah. Check on our mail. Hello? Nope. 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 I, I can't. There's too many things around the mailbox. Yeah, Mango, you're such a good neighbour. I thought I'd send over some animal feed to make your job easier. Keep it up, Marnie. Thank you, Marnie. That's very kind of you. Okay, we have pretty much good stuff going on. Oh, there we go. Got a reward from the sea. Deluxe retaining soil. Um, tomorrow for the row, four, well, five days basically for the wine. Hmm, what have we got today? We can go to the beach and, um, hmm, largemouth bass. That's about it. Hmm, okay, what else am I going to do today? Kind of just waiting for money to be made, aren't I, realistically? Um, let's grab that. Over here. Hmm. I genuinely don't know what to do. Ooh, harvesting things might be a good idea. Yes. Inventory full. <gasps> oh, wow. Okay, veggies. Flowers. Fruit. And, of course, seeds. And we got to level up. Oh, I love it. We've got a whole bunch more sunflowers, which is very nice because, of course, the husband loves them. I'm not going to worry about planting anything else, to be brutally honest. As much as I'd love to get my farming skill up. Mm. Okay, we've got the quarry to do. I guess, realistically, oh, buy staircases at the desert. But well, you know what? I'll do that once we've been to the quarry. And I was going to say, realistically, doing mob hunting is probably a good idea for today uh previous page so we could go to the desert go to this cold cavern and hunt serpents i think there's a whole bunch of other monsters that i technically need to collect oh i don't have the monster musk anymore oh well we're just gonna have to do it the old-fashioned way there we go, get some staircases. Just 11, but every bit of staircase counts, realistically. Right, because it's not a very lucky day. Let's get some food buffs going. Now we're nice and speedy. Alright, let's uh, use some bombs here. Nice. Hey, our first serpent. Go! Oh, yes! And we got a mining level up. How very nice. And we got a combat level up. Always nice. And we got another level up in combat. Very nice. Ah, we're doing it okay. Oh, we got a minus treat off of that skeleton. I am finally bombing the skeletons to complete hopefully the whatever it is the kill them quest basically oh hello serpent come along ow all right i think it's time to leave we did do pretty well on the resources i mean you can see there we got 50 gold that's return ah oh, no i'm sorry i left you out in the rain let's go drop off all of our goodies so we got 
I have a bit of mob drops and their materials. I mean, I can't believe we've got like an iridium bar and stuff. Pretty awesome. Uh, let's drop off that. Ooh, should do my chrysalariums. All of that. Ah, oh, there's even some stairs here. Wow, gold quality prismatic shards. Oh, so lovely. Oh, I fell asleep. Oh. Okay, incubation is two times faster. Natural pregnancy, three times more likely. Increased value of animals are high of friendship. Happy animals produce two times as frequently. Produce worth 5% more for every full barn or coop. Oh, love it. And we got some stuff here. Um, gain one additional ammo slot. 35% chance to recover spent ammo. Fair enough. Good morning. Okay. So we got... Uh, Rascal. Hmm. And then up here, happy animals produce twice as frequently. Okay, so we need to reset the farming. I probably want to make some bits before I do that. We don't need any more kegs or what else? Jars. No, our row production is, well, row age row production is doing well. So, let's just grab these, drop that off, pop some more stuff through. Okay, we will definitely get more coops then. But let's stand up here and have a look at crafting. So, fertilizer. At this point in time, I'm not worried about any seeds. Winter seeds might be a good idea. I will just do eight there. Do we do the tea saplings? I mean, we could. Honestly, probably not needed. Fiber seeds might be worth doing at some point soon. Uh, what else do we get from farming? Oh, there's the monster mask. Whoops. So we only get the keg. We get the sprinklers. So... Let's get a few of these. Right, good. Um, lightning rods, I think we're fine for. I think. Yeah, I think I'm pretty good at this point to just reset. Although we won't really get much farming. Uh, I was about to say experience in winter, but we will because of the greenhouses. Oh, thank you so much for doing that, Sterling. That is very kind of you. Uh, we do have the road to do today. I just want to check on the crops. The genomos are doing that. Okay, let's let's um let's grab the row. Let's have a look. Do we have more quests? We do. Um, Pelican Town, 10 a.m. Okay, okay. So I'm going to pause time. Okay, I'm gonna sell the food that I've got, and then we're gonna go do the row. All right, let's get this row reclaimed. And we're up to 7.25. Nice. Okay, I think it definitely makes sense for me to empty out the milk and eggs uh, collection. And we can see how much more we get from uh, our, our upgrade, basically. Uh, so we got quite a few ostrich eggs, which I should put through now. I'm wondering if I want a whole barn full of ostriches. I think that might be really quite profitable. Hmm. Let me know what you guys think. Okay. Hello, Kevin. How you doing? Hello, Aisha. I've got a new pet cat. I still need to name it. What do you think I should name my new cat? Oscar, Tigger, Indaway. Sorry, I'm not very good with names. Don't ask me. All my animals are named rude words. <laughs> I'm not naming your silly pet for you. Oh, um, ah, I don't know anything about the cat. You need to give me some bits. So I know. 
I'm gonna go in, in there. Oh, very funny. No, I'm not calling it. Oh, I didn't get it. Ah! This is the second time Aisha has got me there. <laughs> to wait, okay. Uh, I was like, that's the most neutral name out of the lot. Very not neutral, though. Juliet, why are you not here? It's 9 a.m. Early doors. All right, let's go. Um, hmm. I did notice on the map the Sen seems to be with the dwarf right now. So let's go over there, see if we can say hello. And then we have something at 10 o'clock. I can't remember what it is, but I'll look and find out. Ah, there you are. No, I wanted to say hello. Hmm, humans just seem to have a tradition in full where they carve pumpkins. They do indeed. Oh, fascinating. I might give it a try myself. Ah, you know, I really like pumpkins. They're very cute gourds. They are indeed. Is pumpkins a favourite for you? Golden pumpkin is. And pumpkins. Ah, and pumpkin soup. And an autograph photo. Oh, so many choices. But we have a gold pumpkin. There you go. Ooh, a pumpkin. Thank you, Mango. You're welcome. I'm going to set this up in my house with a cute little face. Where is your house, Sen? Oh. Ah, Sam and Penny. Oh. Huh? A bird? Is that Leo? Oh no, poor little thing. He must have fallen from your nest. <gasps> no, is it a baby bird? Let me help you. Wow, well done. There you are. Oh, Well done, Penny. Are you just standing over the nest, staring at it? To be fair, I probably would. Whoa, hello, Penny. I didn't know you liked to climb trees. <laughs> oh, hello, Sam. I was helping this little bird that fell from its nest. Well, that's kind of you, Penny. If you're about done up there, I was hoping to hang out with you. Oh, <gasps> Don't fall out! I, I didn't know I'd climbed this high. I don't know how I'll get down. Sam, give her a hand. Um, I, I, I can help you if you want. She probably wants help. I guess I have no choice. I don't know why you'd say it that way. I'd be like, yes, help me. Okay, just jump down and I'll catch you, Penny. You can do it, Sam. Are you ready? I think so. See, I got you. Oh, Yeah. Um, Sam, could you put me down now? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. Oh, Bless Sam. Don't worry, Sam. It's okay. Then, shall we spend some time together? It's a shame Vincent didn't get, like, involved there. I would have liked that. Okay, we've got the beach. Aha, was that the one that I was trying to get originally? The first one. 8pm to 11pm. Um, let's have a look. I think so. Hello, Mayor. Mateo's at the hospital. I hope this discourages people from going too far into the mines. I'm worried about them. Big turnout of Roddy's book launch party. Such a book will definitely boost tourism in the valley. Yeah, probably. Or, um, intrigue. Ooh, yes, let's go talk to the wizard. And Caroline. Yeah, okay, let's go talk to Caroline. Billboards. Okay, I will check. Oh, Caroline's not here? Oh, you're in your sad room. Oh, fair enough. Hello, lovely. What? No, I didn't read Rodney's book and I don't intend to. It's just a bunch of gossips and silly legends. Is that it? Is that all you were saying? I can harvest your bush. Whoa. Mango. That came out so wrong. Um, here, would you like your, your tea back? Oh goodness, are you sure? Yes, yes, because I got it off your plant. <laughs> ah, yes. I've seen many things about your future young Mango. 
If I were to tell you, there would be grave consequences. Yes, but what about the book? Rodney's book. Um... Okay, let's do Robin's resource rush. That should be pretty easy for me. Thousand wood in a week. Let's go up to the other billboard. Okay, ten wire mountain white fishes. Okay, that will do. I don't think I can do the jacket one. I might try for it. Just uh, not this week. Mango, silly, so happy to see Mango. Mango, one of Silly's best friends. Indeed. What can I give you? Apples. Funny. That's the one. Um, Where is my honey? There it is. Wow, so fun. Thank you, Silly. Loves. Oh, I'm so glad. Hello, Jasper. I worked last night in a cold sweat and a horrible noise echoing in my ears. The nightmares plague me, Mango. They make me fear to sleep. Honey, oh, I want to be able to give you a hug. Hi. Hi. Hi, Mango. Please come in. I finally turned up for dinner. I got the bass. Ah, I'm so glad you came, Mango. And you bought the fish. Wonderful. I was wondering, considering how long I left it, whether or not Kemp would be here. Sam, could you come in here and help clean this fish? Yes, ma'am. Hey, Sam. How's you and Penny doing? I can't believe I put that on the floor. Wow, it looks wonderful and it smells so fresh. Thanks so much for doing this, Mango. Kent caught a fish too, but he eats that whole fish to himself. <laughs> fish is pretty healthy. Hmm, that crispy bass was delicious. The breading was to die for. I almost feel like part of the family now. Hmm, floor fish. Floor fish, even. So very tasty. Rodney, how's, how's the book sales been? The valley is such a beautiful place. I really wish I could have enjoyed it with my wife. She never really liked Suzu City, but she agreed to stay there because it was the right choice for my career. I didn't realise that at the time, of course. Oh. Oh. Yay! Hello, Penny. There you are. I was worried you wouldn't come, Sam. Where am I hiding? You know I'd never do that, Penny. Not to you. Aw. Oh. Well, it looks like we're alone. The sea breeze feels refreshing, don't you think? Yeah. I love living by the sea. Um, Sam? Do you know why I asked you to meet me here tonight? I bet you just wanted to see my handsome face. Of course not, silly. It's a bit of a blow, isn't it? <laughs> Poor Sam. How do I say this? I've been meaning to tell you for a while now. About how I feel. I can't stop thinking about you, Sam. I've never felt this way about anyone. I... I... Oh. I see. So you don't feel the same? Mm. No! Penny! That's not what I meant! I... feel the same about you. Oh. Really? Sam, I... Oh, just kiss her! Yes! Now where are they going to live? That's the question I have. Hey there, Mango. 
Come visit me and Helen sometimes. Helen? Of course you can't visit Helen. Can't visit someone who's not here. Oh, I'm sorry, Ezekiel. I was trying to get on my horse. Not cause you stress and upset. Okay, I want to say hello to Electo. And I bet you're over here, aren't you? Yeah, you are. But outside the map. <clears throat> now I guess I could go lumber farming. Marnie, hello. Oh, Mateo, I've known them since they were nugget. Hearing they got hurt like that is devastating. I hope they're back soon. Me too. I love how everyone's kind of just talking about it. It's just sweet. Okay, getting sober made Sterling just 1% cuter. Just 1%? I mean, yeah, they were pretty cute anyway, weren't they? Ster ah, 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 Shane. Yeah, told me about what Sterling did. Proud of him. Ah. Oh. I can't believe my Friday night at the saloon got ruined by this guy's stupid book party. <laughs> Jesse, you're, you're running as well. All holds bittersweet memories for me. It's a time of change and of letting go. It is. And yeah, I can understand the bittersweet feeling of that. And there we go. That completed that. 2,500 gold. Alright, let's drop off everything here. And run that through. And of course we want more materials. Uh, yes, I'm going to continue with the Iridium for the moment. I'm not sure what's the best to be running through right now, but hey, anything being put through I think is a good thing. Uh, let's, let's go for five magma geodes, along with five coal, and then mob drops. Let's pop some stuff through. Um, wow. There is so much here. I'm going to keep the ostrich eggs for the moment. Um, just purely because, well, I have this feeling I'm going to want to put them in incubator. And we've got some more prismatic shards. And they're gold quality as well. 23,000. 7.2 million. I didn't even notice. Did I notice that we went over to the two? Uh, I don't know. <gasps> Electo, I wanted to talk to you today. The fact anyone in the magical, muni magical community still associates with Raz speaks volumes on their poor character. It treats me like garbage, breaks my heart, and somehow I am the villain. You set fire to one High Council warlock and you never hear the end of it. <laughs> oh, don't worry. He's fine now. He simply learned a valuable lesson. Oh, where are you? I'm up in the mountains near Robin's house. Oh. Goodbye, goodbye, Electo. I'm so glad you gave me a call. I wanted to talk to you. Let's see if I can make it to bed one of the nights, eh? Sterling, I'm sorry I didn't come to bed last night. I just got waylaid by the cellar. There we go. That is where I'm going to be ending today's episode. I do hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like. It really does help out the channel. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think of Penny and Stam... Uh, Stam? Sam? storyline uh, so far I, I feel like that's a little bit missing which is understandable in the sense that you know you don't know everything that sort of like happens and how it progresses but it, I feel like it progressed weirdly for me like Penny climbed a tree Sam helped them down and then the next thing we know they're sort of professing their uh, at least attraction for each other and it seems a bit odd because, I don't know, I feel like there was a, there was something missing between those two cutscenes. Let me know what you guys think it down in those comments. But yes, thank you so much for watching, liking, commenting, subscribing, all of that amazing stuff you guys do. And of course, a very special thank you to my wonderful Patreons whose names are scrolling across the screen as I speak. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.